Little Duncan. On BBC Radio Austin. Hello, welcome back to Peter And I'm off to the good partner at the end of the year. I'm off for a bit of crack, the old woman and the beer. I'm off on ship day for a lot of party. Catch me if you can, my name is Dan. I must say it's fantastic being up here today. You know, we've done lots and lots of outside broadcasts down through the years, and they're all out of huge halls and big crowds outside. But we're in here today with a lovely crowd, and it's packed outside as well, because they're here for a bit of crack and a bit of fun, and that's what you get every day on BBC Radio Ulster between a half past three, or half past one and three. What age am I again? 40, ladies and gentlemen. What age am I? See, you're looking, you know, from a distance, you're like a walking rainbow. I believe you're going to Greenmount. I'm going to Greenmount, that's right. I have two boys at Greenmount at the minute, Jason and Jimmy Hunter. Adam, you come in here, Adam. Here's Adam, the young defender. Come on, you boy. How you doing, boy? So, uh, you're, you're one of the organisers over at the, the Greenmount. I am indeed, yeah. Do you know her two cubs? Is that the Hunters? Yes, they live just up the road. You know them? I do, yeah. So, Adam, tell me a wee bit. Now, we're going over to your place on the 25th. Yeah, yeah, the 20, Wednesday the 25th of April. Yes. We're having a big day at Green Mount for the centenary. It's also the open day that day as well. So I think you're coming up next week to confirm things. Well, Joe and myself have been up to confirm things. What do you hear this? Now, people think I'm the stupid one of this outfit. <laughs> but now, Adam, let's take it from the start. Joe, <laughs> Joe found out that one of our uh, editors, Jackie Needle, had a birthday yesterday. So we decided to phone her, Joe phoned her, to wish her a happy birthday. But she said they decided at the same time she'd phone Adam too. So she phoned Adam on the phone and she was texting, texting Jackie to wish her a happy birthday. And when the phone came up, what did she do? Uh, well, I got a voicemail left on my phone with we two were singing happy birthday down the phone. <laughs> so she mixed up the two phones and she started to sing happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, happy birthday dear Hugh. Jackie, from your Uncle Hugo's team too. Got it completely wrong, didn't you? It's my birthday next Thursday, so I thought she was just a week early. <laughs> but she got the name totally wrong. Well, chatting about birthdays is mine and Monday. Yes, and um, did you get a card yet? No. <laughs> <laughs> so you're one of the young defenders. There's a car. Yes, I live to two miles up the road, up in Lagan Alley. Do you? Do, yes. And you know, you can see this man anywhere. He travels all around to concerts. And he's a great supporter of the country music as well. Give Adam a round of applause. Thanks very much. And you're going to invite everybody over that day. Oh, uh, yeah. Everybody's allowed to come. Oh, I, oh, I, you have no say. <laughs> right, we're going back up to the stage.